Tesla is always coming up with innovative solutions to solve problems large or small, and one such example was revealed at the Model S Play delivery in a recent event. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we will talk about Tesla new engine. Elon Musk finally reveals new Tesla engine. But before we begin, I would like you to hit that red subscribe button so that you never miss out on any of our videos. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. Elon also pointed out that this was pretty hard to do since carbon and copper have different rates of thermal expansion. It needs to be wound at an extremely high tension to achieve a carbon overwrap rotor. Electric vehicles are soundless. Even though the Tesla cars are super expensive than internal combustion engine powered cars, they can't make a noise like the ICE engines. But this Tesla Model S Plaid can. This brand new Tesla Model S Plaid makes the noise of a large V8 engine. Watch this video till the end to know everything about the new Tesla engine. Elon Musk has elaborated on details of Tesla's new electric motor, the Plaid carbon wrap motor, and even teased an even crazier higher RPM version coming to the new Roadster. Something we're proud of is the new carbon sleeve rotors for the motor, he said. This is the first time that there's, to the best of our knowledge, been a production electric motor that had a carbon overwrap rotor, he added. One thing we were hoping for during the presentation of the new Model S at the delivery event last week was more details about the new powertrain technology that Tesla developed under its Palladium program for the refreshed version of the electric sedan. Interestingly, the CEO didn't dive too deep into the new technology. For example, he only mentioned a brand new battery pack without going into new details. However, he did unveil Tesla's new played carbon wrap motor and discussed a few details about the new technology which allows for smaller, more powerful and efficient motors. The motors are small enough to be picked up by a single person, while also capable of achieving insane RPMs. During the presentation, Musk briefly touched on the fact that this new motor is only possible thanks to a new machine that Tesla developed to be able to build it. In a new series of tweets yesterday, the CEO elaborated on that machine. Fiber is wound over the rotor at high tension load. The machine to do this was made by Tesla Automation, Carbon sleeve must put the copper rotor in compression or it loosens at low temp due to differential thermal expansion. Preload is also helpful for maintaining a precise gap to the stator. Musk also expanded on the advantages of the new motor over its predecessors. Main advantage of this is a much stronger EM field compared with a rotor that is held together by metal, usually high strength steel. Another advantage is that the rotor can go to higher RPM as the carbon sleeve, mostly, stops the copper rotor from expanding due to radial acceleration. In short, the new carbon-wrapped rotor enables Tesla to push its new motors to a higher level of performance. Again in the same series of tweets, Musk claimed that Tesla's new motor is arguably the most advanced motor on Earth, but he teased that the automaker is working on something even more powerful for the new Roadster. The plate carbon-wrapped motor is arguably the most advanced motor on Earth outside of maybe a lab somewhere. We have to keep some secrets. We have a few ideas for increasing torque and max RPM, even further for the new Roadster. Fun and exciting engineering ahead. Previously, Musk had discussed Tesla using the same trimotor powertrain found in the new Model S for the new Roadster, which could achieve greater performance based on the smaller form factor alone. But now it looks like Tesla could be improving the powertrain technology, too. Of course, when Tesla reveals a new and improved technology, it often hints at something even cooler in store. The played carbon wrap motor is arguably the most advanced motor on Earth outside of maybe a lab somewhere, tweeted Musk. We have to keep some secrets. We have a few ideas for increasing torque and max RPM, even further for the new Roadster. Fun and exciting engineering ahead. Musk recently said that the engineering for the next-gen Roadster will be completed this year and that it will go into production in 2022. A new engineering prototype is expected to be completed sometime this summer. Tell us in the comments section your thoughts. That's it for today. Hope you enjoyed watching today's video. Make sure you subscribe to our channel for more such amazing content. We will see you in our next video. Till then, take care, goodbye.